We are learning new details tonight about an ATM skimmer found this weekend on Madison's east side. Police are asking for people to keep an eye out as they look to see who installed it. Chris Gothner joins us with the update. Chris. Well, Charlotte, you might remember the gas station skimmer epidemic from last year. That got solved, and MPD says it's been a quiet year so far for skimmers in general. But are criminals moving from the pumps to the ATM? We went to police to find out. Something didn't look right to her. It was a customer's intuition that helped Madison police get hold of this skimmer Sunday. She's used this ATM machine in the past, and so she grabbed a hold of the card reader area and jiggled it, and to her surprise, this piece popped off. Police found the skimmer on the ATM of the Monona Bank branch on Atwood Avenue on the city's east side. After further investigation this week, police say today they don't think it was up for long. We believe there were probably around 10 customers who use this ATM. This video shows just how well these skimmers blend in. Monona Bank's vice president of security, Jamie Noyes, says employees check for them every day, but skimmers are often installed at off hours, like like this one was. The most uh, typical time that somebody will try to put these on is over the weekend, over a holiday weekend, um, any time that, that the bank or the financial institution is closed. Then they'll usually be back um, before the bank opens in the morning. He says while staff remain vigilant, it's good for customers of any bank to take a look at the ATM themselves if something looks off. A lot of times they will insert a, a look-alike card reader over the top, so just wiggling this around, as you can see, there's no movement to, to the card reader at all. Pin pads follow the same principle. ATMs are built to be durable. Nothing should be loose. It sticks out from the ATM. Um, looking at that, moving it around. The good news, police say this is likely an isolated incident. There's nothing to indicate a new trend. This is the first one that I've seen this year. Now, Noy says even if you don't think there's a skimmer, it's a good idea to cover your pin as you enter it into the machine. Both police and Monona Bank say they're trying to identify and help any customers who may have been affected. If you have any information on who might have installed this skimmer, call Crime Stoppers. The number is 266-6014. Chris Gothner reporting tonight. Chris, thank you.